It is the 100th anniversary of our national parks. And AAA Colorado and Explore Colorado want to help you explore the parks. We have so many great places to mm -hmm. see. And today we're making a stop at the Great Sand Dunes National Park. And preserve meteorologist and resident explorer Jennifer Broom mm -hmm. takes us to the tallest dunes in North America. The tallest sand dunes in North America started as the result of one of the largest volcanic eruptions ever in Earth's history. La Garita Caldera has a plethora of sand from volcanic ash and dried up lakes. Southwest wind pushed that sand across the San Luis Valley and up against the Sangre de Cristo Mountains. The result is the Great Sand Dunes National Park and Preserve. They almost don't look real. Out of the valley floor, monster sand dunes rising to the sky against a backdrop of jagged snow-covered mountain peaks. They look like a watercolor painting of ocean waves. Sometimes people see different shapes in the dunes. There's uh, horns and uh, faces. Sometimes people see nude bodies, things like that, but there's... <laughs> <laughs> 30 square miles of large dunes that have collected in, the, in this pocket of the mountains. This hiker is close to the top of High Dune. This is the highest dune on the first ridge, and that's the common destination for most people. This is one of the most biologically diverse parks in the United States. Medino Creek is one of the best examples of surge flow in the world. It's a geologically rare phenomenon. Look closely, the water is rolling back upstream. Both of these creeks wrap like arms around the great sand dunes. So kick up your boots and sit for a spell at Colorado's natural beach. Wade through the water. At peak flow, usually in early June, you can even float the creek. Time to tackle the dunes. There's a trick to hiking them. Walk on the ridges. So if you stay on the left side of those ridges, you'll find pretty firm footing and then you want to sled down the east side of the dune faces. Rent a specially designed sand sled or board <laughs> and zip down the dunes. Because we're far from city lights, because of our high elevation and dry air, the night skies here are stunning. And so are the shades of red, yellow, and brown of the vast San Luis Valley to the green of the forest and stark white of snow on the mountains. It's a colorful, diverse world at the tallest sand dunes in North America. It really is amazing. Uh, yeah, that is worth the drive to see. I want to see that too. And also, by the way, to enter to win a $50 gas card from AAA, Colorado, just go to the contest page of our website, kdvr.com. We'll be giving away a gas card every day this week on the contest page. Sand dunes, you want to feel like Lawrence of Arabia. Oh, like I want I to put on like... an outfit like I dream of genie <laughs> yes. or something. Tomorrow, Jennifer <laughs> takes us to Black Canyon yes. of the Gunnison National Park. And also new this morning, more people may be.